Today we're gonna talk about the five things I wish every 20 year old should know uh, when they're starting out in their life and their business and whatever it is. My name is Catalin, I'm from Bucharest, Romania. My door is ringing right now. I'm an entrepreneur, I own a media company called Increase Media and uh, we basically deal with clients from all over the world, from Fortune 500 companies to uh, small businesses and help them with social media and with branding campaigns and all these interesting things. That's what I do. And I thought I'll make this, I will make this video because I really believe I have at least kind of figured out what it is that, you want, that I want to do and what it is that it's aligned with me. And I want to spread that and give that to you. So let's go. You always want to focus on your strengths. There's actually no way for me to actually give the same attention to the $1 million client and to the $500 million client. So today um, I'm gonna give you a video about the five things I think every 20 year old should know and we'll start. So guys, um, I want to tell you five things that I wish every 20, 20 year old should know uh, when they're starting out in their life. Um, and uh, number one is it's okay that you don't have it figured out. Um, so what this essentially means is that when you're like 20, when you're 19, 15, 16, 18, whatever it is, you don't have it figured out and that's perfectly fine. You don't have to. Um, what you do have to do in, uh, in your 16s, when you're 17s, 18s and whatever, um, is that you have to start. You don't have to wait for a college degree to do anything. You don't have to wait for your parents to do anything for you. You can just start right now because doing something right now is at your fingertips because you can just pick up your phone, start a social media account, start learning it, start doing your, doing your craft, start putting your pictures, your paintings on Instagram, whatever it is. So it's at your fingertips. So number one is you don't have to have it figured out. It's okay and you need to start early. Number two is you have permission. And what this essentially means again is I see a lot, a lot of people, and I'm gonna get closer here, but I see a lot, a lot of people, especially young people in their, like between 15 and 20, uh, they are just not doing what they wanna do because they feel like they, they don't have permission. And that comes from a lot of things. That comes from education, that comes from, uh, like the way you've been parented, that comes from the way you had friends, you had your, the way everything happened. And I'm, t I'm here to tell you that you, do, you, you have 100% permission to do whatever it is you wanna do. And if it makes you even more comfortable, nobody else knows what they're doing. So you don't have to like be perfect in your actions, right? You have permission to go out and start doing what it is that you wanna do. And guess what? Nobody's gonna notice if you're doing it badly most of the times because they, they, they don't know what they're doing anyways. You know what I mean? So number two is you have permission. Don't try to look out for permission. Don't try to ask people, is it okay if I do this? If it's okay if I... Do it. Get first-hand experience. That's what's gonna make you better. First-hand experience. Number three, this is the greatest era for young people. I hear a lot of people, especially that I'm 20 and I'm so young and I'm doing all these things and I'm, 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 I'm in my world, I'm crushing it, but it's, it's nowhere near where, at the level I want to be. Um, I see a lot of people like going up at me and like, oh man, you're so, you're so young, how did you do it and all these things, right? And my belief is age doesn't matter at all. And most, even more interestingly enough, I think this is the greatest era for young, young people because you now have a great, great advantage over everyone else. You have technology. And this is related to point number five, but um, when you're young, you have the greatest advantage. You don't have any risk. What do you have to lose? Nothing. 
that's it, right? What do you do? Don't have a family, you don't have responsibilities, you only have like your clothes and maybe some other things and whatever it is. You don't have risks. So now when you don't have risk, it's time to go out and take risks yourself because you don't have anything to lose. So being young and being young in this period of time specifically, in 2017, 16, 18, 19, 20, I think is the greatest era for young people. And you gotta know that and you gotta take advantage of it. It's your responsibility to take advantage of it and make it happen now and it doesn't really matter what age you are. Number four is you gotta love your work. And I stress this a lot on most people. Here's my belief on choosing what you're gonna do with your life. Again, you don't have to choose this right now. My belief is, is if you don't have it figured out, if you don't know exactly what you're gonna do, your best option is to go out and start saying yes to a lot of opportunities. Start experimenting with a lot of things. Go wash dishes, go intern for some financial company. You don't like it? Go intern for a creative company. They like do lots of things. Experiment, experiment, experiment. And you're gonna know in your soul, in your heart, exactly when something fits. But what's most important is you got you need to love your work. You need when you're doing that work, you need to have the reward itself from doing that work needs to be doing the work. It doesn't need to be the money or the fame or any other in any of those things. If doing what you like and what you love get to that, that's fine. But you, if you do it for those reasons, you're gonna fail sooner or later because that's just how it is. So I think it's really, really important, especially if you're young, if you're 20, if you're 16, 17, 20, whatever it is, um, to really spend time with yourself and start asking what it is that you wanna do with your life and start asking those questions. Don't be like everyone else and just think like, oh, I have time, I'm gonna figure, figure that out when I'm 30 or when I'm 21. You're not, to spend time now. Forget about everything else, take a day a week, take two days a week, take a week, take two weeks and just spend it on thinking, what it is that I wanna do, what it is that makes me happy, what it is that I can add value to the world and that it's needed, right? You need to like play with it. There's a lot of things. You need to figure out what it is that you wanna do and that's also needed and that's also gonna be practical. But you gotta mix that and that needs thought and time, so give it that. You're 20, you're 18, you're 19, give it time and tr start figuring out. Fig I saw that, so start figuring out what it is that you love to do. And at least start with something, right? At least you know you're definitely not an accountant, so start with something more creative and go in that direction. You gotta adjust, no worries, start with something. Number five is technology is your greatest competitive advantage. And here's what I mean by that. If you're young right now, you understand social media, you understand technology, you understand the speed at which it goes and how it works and how people react and all these things better than any 45, 50, 38, 45, 64 corporate CEO or CFO or CIO, whatever it is, because you have been in it. Social media is you, you are social media, right? And right now, at the speed that everything is going, understanding technology, it's what's gonna make people stand out or not stand out. It's what's gonna give you a competitive advantage over, the, over your competition, over the other people that need to be hired at the same company that you're hiring for. Let's sum them up. Number one is start early and you don't need to have it all figured out. Don't worry about that, just start, okay? Imperfect action is better than no action. Number two, you have 100% permission to do what you wanna do. Don't worry about that. Just go out and don't ask anybody. Try and fail, try and fail, experiment. Number three, this is the greatest era for young people because it's essentially, you have everything that you need to be successful. Number four, you gotta love your work. And number five, technology is your biggest advantage. So I hope these really help. Um, again, this, this is Callan, and um, this is vlog number 50-something. Um, it's been an inter interesting ride. I hope this really helps you. If it does, please share with somebody that it's in the same situation. If, um, 
If you know somebody that can benefit out of this, just tag them or give them the, give them the link, whatever it is. And uh, let me know what you think in the comments and see you in the next video. If you're in a situation right now when you're thinking, what can you do next? What can you, what opportunity can you take? Here's a really good mindset I have that really helped me start with things. I always say yes to all the opportunities that come my way.